What is up everyone, my name is Odinson and this is Modern Minecraft, Direwolf 20 1.19 pack. Uh, this is episode 17 and all I've done between episodes is, um, well, apparently wait for it to get dark, which is cool, um, is do the whole fighter grow thing that I was doing before and I've stocked up on some of the petals I have got so far. So I'm going to make a, a few more, a couple more of these endo flames. Uh, one, two, one, one, two, the water. All right, two more. I actually wanted one more. So I'm going to go two, one, feed. Water, browns, bread. Gray seed. Window flame. Oh good, and that's perfect. Oh no, he's still going with that coal coke. Wow. That stuff burns for a long time. Okay. <clears throat> uh let's get some music going. Okay. So, beam is still going. Yep. What I can do is, as long as it lands somewhere near, one, two, three, these other three should start up. There we go. You can see the little flame, and you can see this going way faster. That's even without the wand. So, and I'm just going to throw that down because that other one's got to end sometime soon. So if I put the wand in my hand, I can um, see how much is in there. You can see like there's a tiny little blue bit that shows how much mana I've got. So even though this feels like quite a bit of um, mana protection, it really isn't, but it's a good start. And those cold coat blocks are gonna do a good job of getting me started. All right, so that's that. And I can sort of forget about this for the moment because I need the mana generation. To happen so um um i don't think we're chunk loaded here ha gonna have to do that are we chunk loaded here Oops, not that burn. All right, well. I mean, I guess we could just chunk load this one as well. Sure. There we go. No, I don't have to worry about it. All right, so let me just uh, sort out my mess of an inventory. Oh, so, I guess we use that and that. Until we use that, we're going to um, put that away, that away, that away, those away. Okay, I'm going to swap that out for that. Eat. And then we're going to get on with the next stage of auto crafting. So, oh yeah, I wanted to make that, didn't I? That would be a good idea. Let's, um, so I need a piston. Good. That. And then if I could put in the statue thing, so we got this and this. Now I don't know what's how this works or what's gonna happen. I've literally have no idea with this mod. All I know is is that if you put that in there, it, it just stands on there. And if I put the core in there, chisel it. What are you gonna do? You gonna do anything? No, I want the advanced tool tips, please. You do anything, bro? I 
mean, I gave you a core. Uh, yeah, statue loot. 50%, 100% chance of pebbles. The flip do I use pebbles for? Pebbles and facades. Cool. All right, well, I guess we're going to see what he does. I mean... seem to be doing much there. What if we just like stick him in there like that? Be like do stuff. I don't know bro. Alright I'm gonna um stick him down for a minute and see what happens with it. Holy moly we got some service. Oh. Yep. Cool. All right. Well, that's a lot of certs. Ugh. Wrong block. I don't care. Right. The second I'll fix it later. No, I'll fix it now because it's going to really annoy me and I'll forget. You. There we go. I'm sure some of these are probably busted now. Yep, you're busted. Means those crystals will not grow. Damaged. Bored. Chipped. Chipped. Damaged. Chipped. Board. Board. First block. Oh, for goodness. What? Stop it. Um. Annoying. You're also a slightest block. Oh my god. I'm really bad at controlling this laser, guys. Really, really bad. All right. <laughs> of course, I put the wrong one in the wrong place. Get this again, shall we? Okay, go in there. Okay, we're good for a minute. Um, can I get my thingy, my jobby? All right, let's put the certus away. Uh, away. Uh, we should have some charge certus already made up. Yep. Nine and three. What? Blah, in the water, do your thing. There we go. I just need three blocks of any description.
right. Right, so we can go there. And you can go there, and then we can place our Certus. One, two, three. Break up the cobblestone. Are you doing anything, bro? It really doesn't look like it. Maybe you have to live in there. Who knows? All right, so they're all growing now. That's good. Try and get back to what I was doing. Okay. Um, right, so what I want to do is um, actual crafting recipes. So what I'm going to want is a... Is it a pattern encoder or is it an interface now? Anyway, molecular assemblers. <clears throat> oh, never got anything I need. Oak, one, good. Yes. Gonna need, need to go chop a tree, and I. Yep, I want more than one. Of course it's raining. One my saw. Amazing how far them feral flare lanterns light up everything around it. Oh. Six, twenty-five crafting tables. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Molecular. Alrighty. Uh huh. We need some logic processors. Um, start. These will all be going. So that's your first time seeing the actual auto crafting process in motion. All the materials are in there. Right. Okay. So we can now go to molecular assemblers again. We want some formation cores. Got only got a couple. Cause I need some more fluix. Never ends this game. Okay, so I'm gonna a uh, number of items, please. Yep. Where's that charge set of cores? There, we got twelve. All right. A little bit of red stuff. Yeah. Damn it. We're gonna do. We're gonna go toss that in there. I 
it's not quartz, is it? I need never quartz. This. Okay. Did the wrong one. But, but I did need redstone. Which went into my pocket storage. I'll remember this stuff properly one day. There we go, there's a bunch of fluix. Of course the one thing I need is the one thing I've got out. I'm going there. try again. This logic process is, should be all but done now. Another couple of them. And then... Good. I'm pretty sure it's an interface, you know. Pretty sure. Let me just check. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Uh, okay, so I'm not going to be able to do what I wanted to do straight away because I need to make a bunch more co-processing co -processing units behind here to what I actually have right now because this is not going to be sufficient. I've only got one. Not good enough. Um, okay. Of course, I need the three planted. Okay, but what I can do is set up with one molecular assembler of right now, and there is six channels on there, so we can do it. But that's fine. Um, what I need to make is a uh, pattern processing unit. <clears throat> Okay, haven't got any of these, so all these, all these. Can I make you now? Thank you. Uh, I think we'll turn this into a thing. Um, I'm gonna break this for a second. I don't want it to connect straight away. What I'm going to do is, um, yeah, I'm going to put that down there. This is just for an example. That there. And then my Fluix cable. There. That should light up. Yep, it's using seven channels now. So what we could do, we could put basic recipes in here like this. So um, let's say, for example, I want to make a chest. So we go to crafting pattern. Uh, we could search chest. what I'm gonna do is actually I'm gonna go like this hey okay so it does it from the recipe that you put in so oak what I'm gonna do is do this except I didn't want to do that because there was other things I wanted to check put that back in there so substitutions are enabled fluid substitutes fine disabled but what that allows is to when you've got substitutions as enabled if it has got oak it will look for something else it can use to make the same recipe so 
stick that in the pattern provider and what I can do now is like um, if I take my chests out I change this to craftable one next and you're just gonna see it flash Why is it not working? Hmm. Okay. Well, I put the things in there. Very interesting. Let me try something else. I go. Oh, so it needs direct power. Okay. It did work. Did it? Ah. This work? Yes. Oh, and it's made them there. All right, let's try again. Okay, that's working now. Okay, that's good. So, um, yeah, I've got the recipe in there and it will craft it for me. What you could do is, it's like if you put a crafting card into um, here and everything, if you have the no planks and you put the oak recipe in, uh, oak to planks recipe in there as well, if you go to make a chest and you haven't got planks, it'll craft the planks first and then make the chest. So that's what the crafting cards are for as well. So, um,. Yeah, that's good. I'm going to put a few recipes in there as we go along. What I'm probably going to do now, um, I'm pretty much out of channels on this line now, aren't I? I'm probably going to be pretty close to out of channels on this line, to be honest, with all this stuff. Got one, two, three, four. I've got four on there. Huh. Okay. Well. Shall we um, do the pulverizer while we've got a few minutes? Why not? Uh, I will take you, my friend. Hmm. Um, and what I'll do is I'll... Uh, I know what I'm doing. I'm a professional. I do that instead. Yes. Okay. I'm going to want my exchanger. I can do that. And I'm going to want my pocket storage. Okay. 
but I can just go like that. All right, tidied it up. I tidied the things. Right, he's getting power over there, so he doesn't need power. He's only got power going that way. Ugh. Right, I'm kind of making myself more and more of a challenge as I think about this. Yeah. One, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, I need some universal cable. Not in there, it's in my backpack, of course. 14. Ooh, is that going to be enough? No is the answer. Why did you place there? There, there, and there, please. And there. Okay, gonna play this game. Okay. Where's my thing? My telegic confuser's not in here yet. Is that okay? And I need actual iron. Ugh, not that. Okay. Go, go, go. World's quickest way to make steel. Uh, and now I'm actually going to dump a bunch of this in the system, I believe. Okay. Um, this quickly first. There we go. That's a stack of that. I'm gonna dump the redstone into the system because I need redstone. We're gonna get there, boys. We're gonna get there. All right. You can come back up. And then that there, and then I could stick the pulverizer on top. We've got power, flint can go in there, and then I want some kiwi to repair the floor. Uh, that. Okay. Like nothing happens, right? Um, so I need a pattern provider. <clears throat> yes, more. Okay, put that back, put that in there, and I want an import bus. Oh, not a pinport. Okay, you, which means I'm gonna need one of them. One of these. And then turn that into a sticky. And then an import bus. Okay. I'm gonna to wanna to open my backpack. Get out my Fluix cable. 
All right, so what I want to do is put the import bus there, uh, the pattern provider there, and then the import bus there. And what I set that out as, that's off now. That is your output. That is your input. And then if I, what, uh, uh, like that. And that's got to be most of the channels on that line now. But what I can do is, if I make a pattern for, so I'm gonna need to, this. Uh, processing gravel makes sand we need to put oh my god there at the top gravel we go goes into there if I put that in the processing pattern right we go sand I take out what we got I'm gonna craft pen start are you working yes it's working just want to see that it um actually ex imports to the system yes it does perfect all right so that's how i've now automated the uh, pulverizer as well i could put some recipes in there for stuff that i need pulverizing so that's good so so far this episode we've done the botan botania botania stuff we're going to progress with that over the next few episodes we've put a auto crafting square on there although i'm going to make a big christmas tree thing with these so i've got that like hundreds of recipes available to me um i'm going to expand the actual crafting storage i'm going to do that and then also we've automated our pulverizer for today so that's it for today's episode hope you've enjoyed it uh, my name's odinson and as always take care